Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. Uh, the graphic adventure for more point-and-click adventure game action. We are right back where we left off in Henry Jones's apartment, taking a look around. Um, we found the sticky tape at the end of the last episode. Uh, so we're going to carry on looking around just to make sure we didn't miss anything. And then I think we're going to have to have a look around the office in the college again. Because I wonder if we've got something that we can... Um, use to get this sticky tape or whatever's in the sticky tape open but first if you haven't already done so make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell down below the video so you get a notification to your device every time i upload and as always guys thank you all for your ongoing support so um i'm just going to try and move in bits and pieces around in here just because um can we do anything to chuck the plant no you can't move it i'm also going to try picking things up because there's bound to be more things we can pick up or oh I didn't realize we could go in here can we open the window this window hasn't been opened for years okay um what else do we have this typewriter here can we use that oh we can didn't really seem to do anything though uh can we I guess we can't pick it up and take it with us no um what's this plant over here can we pick that up Ah, okay, so he's put it down. So that makes me think maybe there's something on here. No, can we pick up the tablecloth? Okay, chest, what's this? Can we open this up? Open the chest, it's locked. Okay, maybe we need the key. Is the key in the sticky tape? Hmm, let's try it. Let's try using the sticky tape on the chest. It doesn't unlock it. Okay, so it looks like we need to find a key then to be able to open that up. We haven't found a key anywhere else though. Um, can we pick up any of the stuff on the bed? Nice, no, too heavy. What about this picture? We tried picking that out before, didn't we? Yeah, we'll leave it here. I wonder if we can pull it off the wall or something. Maybe there's a safe behind there? No. Okay, what about this picture here? painting can we pick that up okay we can what's that on the wall behind it well i don't think there's actually anything there can we pick up some of these books it doesn't look like we can um okay let's take a look at this painting maybe there's something on it it's a painting oh yeah he said that before so i wonder why we had to take that and of course if we look at the sticky tape it's kind of lumpy. That makes me think there's something in it. Um, we tried picking up some of the books on here. There's not a secret passage or anything behind this, is there? Oh yes, I remember these books. I just assume forget them. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, maybe we go back to the the college now. Um, we're going through the window. So, there's this water heater here. We can't use the sticky tape on that, can we? Like, melt it or something? I mean, I'm pretty much trying anything I can here. That doesn't seem to work. Okay. Um, what else do we It's just junk, stones, jar. What's the jar? It's full of solvent. I use it to clean. Oh, okay. Uses it to clean. Oh, can we use it on the painting? Uh, use the jar with the painting. That doesn't seem to work. Okay. Um, what else do we have on here? Jar. Just stuff. Mask. I think we looked at most of this, didn't we? Um, there's the phone, we can't use that. Can't use the light switch, I don't think. Crystal ball. Did we look at the crystal ball? Not sure we did, actually. I see some difficult times ahead. Well, that's for sure. <laughs> Things are going to get a little bit ropey. We looked at this, didn't we? Let oh, it's not junk mail anymore. Can we pick them up? Oh, so we've got some letters now. 
Oh, it's more. Ju oh, it's more junk letters. Can we open it up? Nothing important. Okay, is there papers now? Right. Okay. Oh, so this. Oh, there's something underneath it all. It's just papers. Nothing. What is that? Package. Let's look at that. Look at the package. It's a package from my father. Oh, so it's buried beneath all the things. I still haven't watched the movie yet, by the way, so... Uh, hmm, this looks important, but I'll leave this other junk here. Right, I see. So we had to pick all that up to get that package. So, is he just going to... Yeah, it's from his father. Let's open it up. Uh, open the package. It's my father's grail diary. Oh, okay. I remember this from the film. Right, let's look at it. I don't see anything pertinent right now. Uh, do we have to open it? All oh, right, okay. So it doesn't look like we can actually use it, weirdly. Um, can we use the sticky tape on the diary? That doesn't seem to work. Hmm, okay. Um, we haven't missed anything else, have we? There's just junk down here. Just some old books and worthless trinkets. Okay. Um, it's not very much in here. The masks we looked at. There's the Sam and Max totem pole. What about the ancient tablet? I haven't finished translating it, but I think it's a warning about aliens in disguises. Right, okay. Um, can we use the sticky tape on the tablet? No. Can we use the sticky tape on the painting? That doesn't seem to work. Hmm. Can we use the grail diary on this jar? Use the jar of the grail diary. That doesn't seem to work. Can we use the jar on the sticky tape? We can! <gasps> There's a key! Okay! Right, that must be the key we need. It's a very small key. I bet that's the key that opens up the chest. Oh, so I see, we had to use the jar. <laughs> well, okay, I was quite lucky that I did that. That was a complete fluke, by the way, guys. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't plan that one out, don't worry. I wasn't that smart to actually figure out the solution to that puzzle. <laughs> right, let's um let's use the small key on here and hopefully this will open this chest. Yes. What do we have in here? It's a ch it's just the chest, is it? I don't see anything special about it. Oh, there's an old book in here. Right, okay, let's pick up the old book. Is there anything else in here? No, okay, let's look at the old book then. This is the diary I made when I was a little boy. It was supposed to look like my father's grail diary. I see. So can we open that? No. Can we use the grail diary on the old book? No. Okay. So we can't... I don't see anything pertinent right now. So we can't... Hmm. Is it time to head to Venice, maybe? I, thought, I, feels like, I feel like the game would maybe prompt us if we were supposed to go to Venice. But maybe not. Right, so we can't open these windows. We're already getting enough air through the door. That's a fair point. <laughs> Um, yeah, I honestly don't know. Maybe it is time to head to Venice, but I don't... Right, I know what I'll do. We'll go back to the college, and we will save. So, let's um, save the game. You can see my save from last time there. We'll call it 2. Okay, so the game was saved. So... Let's carry on. So we've saved just in case we um we do something wrong and hit a dead end. And I don't I don't want to start the whole game again. So um let's try to go to the plane to Venice. Oh cool. 
Oh, I like this. This is really cool. Ha, oh, nice. Ah, oh, Venice. How are we supposed to recognise our contact, Dr. Schneider? Maybe he'll recognise us. Dr. Jones? Yes. I knew it was you. You have your father's eyes. And my mother's ears, but the rest belongs to you. Oh my god. <laughs> so cringy. Looks like the best parts have already been spoken for. Marcus Brody? That's right. I'm Dr. Elsa Schneider. Oh. So, uh, could you tell me about my father's disappearance? Of course. We were working in the library when it happened. I'll show you. Why don't you two go ahead without me? I think I'll take a nice relaxing gondola ride. Very well, Marcus. Dr. Schneider, you lead the way. I like the music. That's it, we go into that church, don't we? Oh, the library, that's it. It's a bit church looking. Yeah, there we go. I remember it from the film. You couldn't be more right. It was a church during the Crusades. Now, just before your father vanished, he was muttering something about Roman numerals. Okay. He said he'd searched everywhere for them without success. The library should be closing soon. I'll make sure we won't be bothered. Then we can take a look around. Excuse me, sir. Pardon me. Oh, this guy stamping on his books. I doubt we'd much trouble, Dr. Schneider. Oh, this guy really loves his job, doesn't he? <laughs> God, is it going to keep making that noise forever? <laughs> oh, look, we've got our whip now. Let's look at the whip. Never leave home without it. Well, you did when you went to the college, didn't you, Indy? So, it's not technically true. Oh, okay, this is an area here. Uh, how do we... Oh, there we go. Walk to the next room. So there's stacks of books. I'm guessing we can probably go down this way as well. Uh, oh, we can't actually. There's a plaque here. Let's take a look at that. It's an Italian proverb. A library without bookshelves is like a haphazard pile of books. <laughs> okay, makes sense, I guess. Um, oh god, there's more stacks down here as well. Uh... Oh, I remember this from the movie. Dad searched for Roman numerals everywhere. They're literally on the floor. Okay. Oh, God. Can we go down here as well? Whoa, this place is huge. Huh? Uh. Are they different rooms? It looks like it's taking us around in a circle. Okay, that's kind of confusing. Uh, let's look at this plaque then. Is just driving me out of my mind. Line five. What? And my deep indignation. Oh, okay, so they're in an order. So let's look at this. Yeah, let's look at this one. I don't see anything special about it. What? I want to look at the plaque. The library staff apologises for the defaced plaques in this section. The employee responsibility, uh, the employee responsible, has been terminated. Oh, so we can't read them all. Uh, look at the plaque, please, Indy. An emphatic librarian said, "These inscriptions just make me see red." Oh, they are different because the stained glass window is slightly different. Okay, let's walk to this plaque. Uh, why does it not remember that you've clicked look sometimes? They are clear fabrication. This is a puzzle, isn't it? If I remember right, in the film, I mean, as I said, I haven't watched it again yet. I am going to watch it again very soon. Um, don't we get attacked here by people? Isn't that a thing? God, how many of these... What is that? There, that book looks kind of suspicious. Fascist propaganda. Okay. I don't suppose we can pick that up. No. Um, 
Don't we get attacked? But, oh, God. Yeah, look, it's a slightly different room. Um, I don't know how we get back to the main room. Hang on, what's this? This looks a bit suspect down here, doesn't it? Something funny about these books. What about snakes? I hate snakes. He does indeed hate snakes. Um, and actually, there's that famous scene in the first one, Raiders of the Lost Ark, I think it is, where he falls down into... Oh, what's this? There's a fence here. Where he falls down into that pit, like under the sand with the snakes. And um, when the lightning flashes, you can actually see the reflection where there's a bit of glass between him and the snake. It's like a really famous sort of mu movie error, isn't it? But it's, it's quite cool. I'd highly recommend the movies, by the way, if you haven't seen them. They are great movies. Um, oh, so it's a circle. I see. So, if it's a circle, maybe the clues are something to do with these plaques. Donated by Giorgio Lucazzi. <laughs> Sounds very similar to George Lucas, doesn't it? Okay, we read that one. I wonder if it's going to be something to do with these. It's in Italian. Okay. Can we talk to this guy? He's doing my head in with this flipping... We can't use the talk command. We use the whip on him to shut him up. Shut up. That's not what I carry a whip for. <laughs> well, you never know. Can we go back outside, by the way? Oh, we can. Nice. Can we go? Uh. Oh, here we come. We're going up the stairs, I guess. Can we go? Oh, we can go back to America. Cool. Now, if I remember right, this manhole cover, that's where we come out, isn't it? Can't seem to budge it. Yeah, I think, if I remember correctly in the movie, we find a secret passage under the floor, under those Roman numerals. Um, and then we eventually come out of that manhole cover. I'm sure that's what happens. Um, I guess we've got to go in here and solve this puzzle. Um, I'm not really sure how to go about that just yet, but we'll figure it out. We'll um, take a look at... I think these ones are just quotes, aren't they? Yeah, they are, I think. Right, let's try going down here. Maybe there's something to do with all these books. Maybe one of the bookcases is a secret book or something we need to get. Tales of the Ark of the Covenant and other landish, outlandish folk stories. Right. <laughs> Actually, can we look at this now that we're here? I don't see anything pertinent right now. Okay. Can we not... We literally can't use that. That's really strange. Uh, can we pick up any of these books? Doesn't look like it, does it? Now, if I remember rightly from the film, I think the one we want to do is the one with the fence, because don't they find whatever square they've got to get under with the Roman numeral, and then use this pole, or one of these poles, and they smash their way through the concrete? To get underneath i'm sure that's what happens but um we're gonna have to try and figure out what roman numeral we need to get under and i'm not really sure how to do that i don't see anything special about it i think i clicked on the shelf by mistake instead of the plaque ah venice its library is fit for a king marco and giuseppe palmieri the geography section is rounded out well christopher columbus The biology section is primitive now, but every day it grows more fit. Charles Darwin. Okay. I wonder how we figure out the deal with the... Right, okay, anyway. this These are just quotes. Can we look at this window? It looks very familiar to me. Okay. We can't open it, can we? Maybe we have to use the book on it. Maybe that's how we use the Grail Diary. Is that we use it on something. That doesn't seem to work. Okay. Use the Grail Diary with the wind. I don't... 
I don't know if we actually have to use the Grail Diary, but I'm assuming we probably do. Um, there's nothing that stands out, obviously, on this bookcase, is there? No. Okay, what about this one? Does this one look familiar? It looks very familiar to me. Oh, it does. Um, okay, what about these plaques? Was this the one that we saw before? With... Um, why a duck? <laughs> yeah, there's lots of famous quotes. You're supposed to be reading the books, not the plaques. Right, okay. I don't know if that's a clue that we need to be looking at for books. Superb library with dull ceiling, Mike Angelo. <laughs> I like that. Uh, right, okay. Maybe there's a book we've got to find. Can we perhaps use the Grail Diary with the books? It doesn't look like you can actually use the Grail Diary on anything, weirdly. Now this one's different. It's got what looks like a devil or something up on the top. It looks very familiar to me again. Hmm. Okay, guys. Um, I think we will probably leave it there for today's episode. I'll have to have a little bit of a think. I'm thinking it's going to be something to do with the plaques or the books. That's the only thing that springs to mind at the moment, but maybe it's something to do with that guy sitting in the reception who keeps thumping that stamp down on the books as well. <laughs> um, but we'll, we'll figure it out. Don't worry, we will figure it out. I like the fact that, because I haven't played this game before, and the fact that the puzzles are actually a little bit difficult, it's, it's really causing me to think, and I love that. So I'm really excited to play more of this, but for now... We'll call it an episode. So, as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I will see you all next time.